What is up my dogs? Today we're playing this Evolve Royal Recruits Evolve Zap deck that I made to get to 9,000 trophies and also Yapper Man is back. That's right. I saw someone called me the mayor of Yapsville recently and also like someone else commented like oh I don't remember ordering a Yappuccino <laughs> like finally my Yappuccino is here but that's what we're doing today. I want to talk about how I watched June 2 recently. If you don't know what that is, it's basically a movie that came out in the cinemas recently. And it's basically like Star Wars on the sand. It's like there's two, t there's two sides and, you know, there's the good guys and then there's the bad guys. And they're fighting over like a resource on some planet. And it's this, I don't know, it's this whole big story, right? And they, had a, they, they have like a bunch of A-list actors in these movies, right? And I just finished watching the second one. And I looked at all the reviews before I watched the movie and everyone's like, wow, they really nailed it this time round. Like June 2 is one of the greatest movies of this generation. And so I went into it with, you know, I, I don't take reviews, like movie reviews with the highest, the highest, you know, like I don't hold it up to a great standard because I, I, don't, I just don't trust reviews because they're always hit or miss. And I watched the movie and I was just kind of like, that was all right. Like I wasn't blown away by it. It was just kind of meh. And I was just like, what the fuck? Why is everyone geeking out over this movie? Is it because it has Zendaya and Timothy Chalamet and all these big actors? Probably not, because there are a bunch of movies with big actors that still flop. And so I just didn't get it. I thought it was good, but not great. The third Star Wars, that's a great movie, for example. Morbius, that's a great... No, i joking. But yeah, and so I, I didn't really... I didn't really feel it. And I've been watching movies a lot. I used to watch movies all the time in my teen years. Actually, looking back, okay, first of all, I'm not a role model, okay? If you hear things from me, don't aspire to be anything like me. And I know that half of you don't because, good. <laughs> but basically, me and my friend, we used to do this little thing in our teen years where we would spend our weekends, because there were, there were always new movies that came out, like every weekend it felt like. It was so great back in the day. We had this like local cinema that was kind of, I don't know, on its way out, I guess. And um, we used to always just come up with a plan on how we were going to get into the cinema because we don't have we didn't have any money we were young teenagers working like job part-time jobs and getting paid fuck all <laughs> so we tried to figure out ways of how we could sneak into the cinema without paying and like sometimes there was a guy there sometimes there wasn't um, and like we'd come up with plans like, okay, you go into the toilet and then you buy, we'll buy one ticket and then I'll pretend you have the ticket and you go into the cinema and you'd be like, yeah, my mate's waiting in there. And like, we'd come up with all types of strategies. It was pretty fun looking back, pretty degenerate stuff, but pretty fun. And so by the way, what is going on in this game? What is actually happening? Like I have not paid a single, I'm yapping my ass off. You know what? I am going to change my Twitter bio to the mayor of Yapsville because I think I've earned it. Okay. Maybe you guys are right. You know what? Fuck it. We're going to do this. Um, mirror them. Um, yeah, I've earned the title. So that's my new Twitter bio. bio. What am I even saying? But yeah, we used to sneak into movies all the time. And I feel like what happened to good movies, man? I used to watch a movie like every time in the cinema. I feel like maybe this is just my nostalgia playing a, um, playing a factor here, but I swear like, like there were always good movies coming out. Now, I don't know if it's my age or I don't know if it's COVID or what changed, but I rarely even want to watch a movie in the cinema now. And I was that guy that always used to go. I loved going to the cinema and, um, now I just never. And like June 2 was the last one I went to. Cause I was like, okay, this one has really good reviews. And that's why I, I think I'm in the minority here. I feel like most people are like, yeah, June 2 was a generational film, <laughs> but I just don't think it was. Am I crazy? <laughs> I bet most, most of you haven't even seen the movie. Most of you probably don't even watch movies anymore, but I think, I, I definitely think COVID had a massive hit on the, uh, the movie industry, but man, I miss it. I love the theater going experience. It's not even about watching the movie. I know a lot of people who don't want to watch movies. I have friends that would rather just play games or just don't like going to movies in general. And I get it. I get it, like having your own time, not having to like spend two hours committed to a movie. But when you find the right movie or you watch some shit that's actually good, it's so good, man. I miss that. I also miss just doing shit with my friend like that. Although that was not a good thing. Guys, don't do that. Also, how is this game still going? It Like, okay. <laughs> As I say that, it fucking ends. All right. Thank you, Fable from Greedy Goblins for finally getting that over and done with. But yeah. 
I used to I used to enjoy that whole process. Um, we always had this one mission or something we were always gonna do, but we never did it. Maybe someone will have to carry on the torch for us. Don't do this, I'm joking. This cinema we actually used to always sneak into, uh, basically went down the drain and shut down. That's kind of why we started doing it as well, because like we knew it was on the way out. And so we were just like, yeah, fuck it. Um, and they, they wouldn't even have people there anymore. They literally didn't give a fuck. Um, and so one day we had this mission that we were gonna do like a whole day marathon. Like we were gonna go in and we were gonna watch movies the whole day. And it was going to be so fun. But that kind of thing sounds better in theory than it actually is, if you know what I mean. Because usually there aren't that many... Like, it sounds fun to spend a whole weekend in the cinema. Like, a whole day in the cinema. Just constantly watching movies. Bouncing from movie to movie. I even thought back in the day of making a video of it. This was back in my, uh, on my old channel's days. Um, but I never did because it wasn't really similar to Clash Royale content that I was making. Um, but there's never going to be enough movies that are good enough to make you want to actually do that. Because by the time the weekend rolls around as a kid, you spend all day at school. You know, you want to do some shit that's actually fun. You know what? We're going to use the Evolve Zap here because it's just going to kill it. Could have activated King, but... Oh, the stun is going to allow the bats to get hits as well. Yeah, you want to spend your weekend wisely. And um, as, a, as a kid, a young, youthful child, there is... As opposed to the crooked old fuck I am now. There's a plethora of options. But not anymore. Now it's just everything's misery. And so you've got to be careful about how you spend your weekends. Because it comes by quick. And it goes even faster. And so we never did it. We never spent the whole day at the cinema. But that ah, sounds fun, man. Sounds fun. We should have done it. Um, if only there was a lineup. Imagine it was just like, yeah, Star Wars and the new Avengers movie. And like, I don't even know. I don't even know what qualifies as a good movie anymore, to be honest. It's crazy how Marvel's also gone downhill. This is just good. Yeah, Yapper Man is in full form. Mayor of Yapsville is in full form right now. Um, what happened to Marvel as well, dude? That shit used to be the greatest thing ever. I used to feel like I was in the minority of people who liked Marvel movies back in the day, man. Because, I, I, I don't know, it just wasn't a thing. Back in the day, <laughs> this is the guy who's you know, thinks he's cool to be to the trend first. But back in the day, like, Marvel was cool amongst guys, I think. But not amongst everyone else, I think. Because um, they would release, like, Iron Man and... I'm trying to think what movies kind of came... Like, Captain America. I remember I watched one of the Captain America movies with my dad when I was younger. He took me to it. And... I remember not even knowing that it was a Marvel movie because I just, I'd never heard the name Captain America. That's, this is the time period I'm talking about. And I remember watching it and it was, I think it was Captain America, the Winter Soldier was the movie title. And I remember being like, wow, this is so fucking good. Like no other movie is doing superhero shit like this because all I could remember um, was the old DC movies back in the day. And so when Marvel came through with this, um, it's kind of like high quality fast paced sort of style. I, I just, I was in love with it. And um, it was so sick the way they like, they intertwined characters from other movies. It's like when your favorite YouTubers do a collab, but on crack, I don't know. And they're superheroes, which is just so, it was just so sick back in the day. But they are, uh, they definitely beat that to a pulp, that whole style, you know, with getting like cameos in movies. People got sick of it real quick, and that's literally the whole basis of what Marvel is now. It's literally just, you know, which super cool superhero is going to appear in the next big Marvel movie. Um, all right, to finish off today, I wanted to try and win for 9,000 trophies. Finally, the universe is coming to an end as Ken is getting to 9,000 trophies with 1.5 cycle. Pretty much the quickest cycle in the game if I put in Heal Spirit and Mirror. And Megatron is going to be my victim. I'm pretty sure we can win with this. Everyone's playing Wall Breakers as well. If you have Evolved Wall Breakers, it's just broken. But yeah, I miss those days. I, I used to love going to the cinema, man. Which was the... Wow, he's actually going to connect. I swear I had that covered. All right, buddy. Got a bit of a menace on our hands. But yeah, those were the good old days. <sighs> now nah, we're living in the good old days now. I hate that the, the saying that you never know when the good old days are. You're living in them until they're gone. I want to live my whole goddamn life in the good old days. Because that's how it's been so far. And you know, there's ups and downs always. But I will always live in the good old days. Forever, guys. And I want you guys to do the same. That's the one piece of advice I'm going to pass on. Make your life eternally 
the good old days. And it doesn't matter how many broken evolutions are in the game. God damn, bro did not. He has seen some shit. <laughs> because he was not giving those Evolve Wall Breakers the time of day. And um, yeah, he paid the price because fucking hell. Megatron's tower is taking a beating. <laughs> um, all right. Well, I guess he's going to go with something here, right? Because he played that. Yep. Oh, God. Nope. Don't like that. Yep. Kill that real quick. I love the fact that I can just... This deck is ridiculous because Evolve Skeletons come every, what, two cycles? Evolve Wall Breakers come every two cycles, and they're both fucking broken. And I'm playing a cycle deck, and they come so quickly, and cycle cards are actually just good. Um... I should have played Fire Spirit by itself. Oh, the bats are going to get chip damage. I take it back. I'll just play Spear Goblins of the Bridge. I don't care, Megatron. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no! No! Oh, my God. That had me geeking. I am so paranoid when it comes to Evolve Skeletons. Please, let mine survive. Oh, okay. Magic Archer. Holy tornado. Okay, he's definitely going for a thing here. Okay, he's definitely not going for a thing here. I'm just going to have to keep... This is like a cycle matchup. Is he going to log? What's he going to do? He he is not taking chance with the Evolve Wall Breakers. I don't blame him. Those things are ridiculous. Okay, perfect. Wait, that's not perfect at all. What the fuck? That was bullshit. Okay, Evolve Knight, relax, buddy. I know what you're like. Um, okay, we've got a Spear Goblin Horde in the other lane. But yeah... I felt like, um... Okay, you know what? I felt like talking about that for some reason today. Just some movie stuff. Brought back some good memories, you know? The good old days. The good old days, which are now, is what I meant to say. Right now. The, 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 the good now days. I don't know what I'm saying. All I know is that... How is he going to defend all this? He's going to tornado. And the magic archer is going to fucking... Oh my god, he still had to play a log. Alright, he's going to think he's cool going for a minor to protect this. What he doesn't realize is that I can just go bing bong bang. And win both towers? Win both towers? Who says that? Oh no. They're here. Alright, they all died. Okay, perfect. Boom, boom. Now, this is actually kind of a nuts match. No! Okay, buddy. That bomb tower is actually annoying the fuck out of me. How am I going to win this? Okay, we're going to have to wait. Fuck, dude. Fuck. Shit. If I keep swearing, will it make it better? Okay, he's gonna go with Bomb Tower again here. Does he have the elixir? He just spent a ton of elixir. Oh no. Oh no, he let one connect. He can't do that, Megatron! Surely... Okay, yep. Yeah. I was gonna say surely those bypass the Bomb Tower. But... Oh, okay. He does the same thing every time. You don't think I can keep up, mate? I am the cycle god. You don't know what you're messing with, Megatron. Okay? Good thing I'm not telling the story in this game, because Christ on a bike. What is happening? Okay, we're fine. Yep, Bomb Tower dies. Just... Okay. This is coming down to the wire. That Magic Archer is getting so much fucking value, dude. It needs to stop. Okay, surely that miner gets caught. We can't really afford to take, like, any damage. Oh, the Evolve Skeletons! Oh, double wall breaker connection! Okay. Alright, you know what? Let's go like this. Oh, yes! Kill the Evolve... Wait, what the fuck? Wait, 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 no, 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 no! No, 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 no! No, what?! What the fuck?! How did nothing kill the Evolve... Megatron! He's throwing emotes at me! Oh my god, I just ruined my recording completely. Oh my god. Alright, you know what? Maybe that's what God wanted, for me never to reach 9,000 trophies. How did the- I wasn't even looking and they snuck past the slimy meatballs. Alright, well, there you go. That was a bit of a- That was an epic video. You know what? There's no- there's no downplaying it. Smash subscribe for more epic content. <laughs>